Look how beautiful that is. And I love that it's outside on a covered porch that you can use this inside. It, these are hand painted. They're screens with fall designs, first day ever, presented at the clearance price. The four easy pays will go away at the end of the day. The clearance price will save you almost $15. Four easy pays at $4.99 on this. And there's two choices for you. One says gather, the other says happy fall. This to me, Ginger, I mean, it blew me away when I saw it, first of all. Thanks. That it's nineteen ninety nine with the four I easy know. pays. I mean, and it's really, really oh, here. It's really amazing. Like people go to and take classes to learn how to do this. They do. They really do. And that, you know, to tribute to the, the artists that they have yes. um, at, at Plow and Heart, they really do such an exquisite job. You know they have to be good in order to do so many of these. And they are individually hand painted over that screen. Look at that. We all love our signs, Pat. We, they're signs that are everywhere. When you go into the craft stores, you can make signs. You can, you know, buy the signs that already have the little things on them, but not like this. Not done and a screen that is beautifully, gorgeously done with a frame all the way around it. You also have the hanger on the very back side. Both of them are going to be a little bit over 15 inches square, but that elegant fall theme statement in, and you know, just gorgeously done in that frame. I just think this is a this is so beautiful. I actually have an overhead camera. I want to turn it around to kind of show you how beautiful it is, is on the back. So you can see they hand paint this on the back side, but you have to do it in a certain way so that certain things like the inside veining is done first. Then you have that coloration around the outside of the leaves. Same thing on the pumpkins. And I love that we've added that blue pumpkin because coming up, we have that, that rug that's mm -hmm. on the bottom, on the floor oh, there. Perfect. I love blue pumpkins and white pumpkins. I love all the different colors that are kind of mixed and matched, but done in a gorgeous wreath. And happy fall, y'all, because you want to say it with a little bit of an accent, don't you? <laughs> I love it. It reminds Either me of one. Kim Gravel. <laughs> <laughs> and, that, and that's a wonderful, wonderful way to think about it. You know, the right. gather, again, if you take a look, and this is just by accident, just how we have the most amazing set stylists. You know that, Ginger. You've been here. Yes. Um, how yes. they redecorate things. But there it, are the yellow leaves. Why couldn't you put this on the wall and in fact elegant here mm -hmm. if you don't mind you know and you could go ahead and hang this on the wall and it has a really great presence to it and because it it's a screen a literal screen very fine screen you can see whatever texture is behind it which is like super mm -hmm. super cool do you mind if i run over to the blue um here come with me wait i have to go around that way it's because so you know, even if you lean it. this up against yes. any sort of a, of a, a chair, a desk or a, a um, the backside of a, you know, leaning it up against if you have a table. But, but I even put mine Look in an that. easel because I, I have an mm -hmm. easel. That's beautiful, too. Isn't that beautiful? Any sort of background, it just matches. Yeah. Look at that. Even just setting it on a, a little easel and just putting it on the floor or putting a little easel up higher where, you know, you can just kind of decorate anywhere. And I love that we have this so coolest. you can put it under a cover. It's so beautiful. It's so beautiful. Great piece to accent with. Let's because otherwise, out. it would be boring, wouldn't it? <laughs> well, <laughs> Ginger, let's call out the, um, my frame is more of a natural frame on the gather. Yes. Yours is white. It is more like a whitewashed mm -hmm. and it, it kind of like an antiquing done to it. So they are a little bit, uh, probably about one and a half inches for that frame. But just the frame alone, yeah. if you go to the store and you get a frame, um, of course, you'd have to stretch that and paint it. It's, there's a lot of detail yeah. that is put in there. A lot of work. This. And it's, it's a lot of work. And it's Plow and Heart. Plow and Heart, they're known for their quality. And they do have their artists that are in-house that do exquisite work. Now, my mother is a painter, and she loves it for years, has painted, and put the brush down. Oh, when she retired, she just said, I'm not, I'm done with this. But she's about, she's 86. She'll be 87 this, oh, this uh, month. Oh, Ginger. Yeah, and she's oh, going to be picking birthday. up the brush again. Thank oh, you. Oh, my I gosh. Good for her. I know. 
I love her. She's even thinking about teaching again. Isn't that crazy? That's I love amazing. It. Good for her. <laughs> Tell her to go for it because we I could will. learn a lot from her. That's just amazing. Oh, completely. You know, <laughs> completely. that's so cool. But we all know like what goes into it mm -hmm. because if you were to pick up a brush and start to do something like this, you know, it would be your own your own artwork, which would be great. But you know, I mean, to get something that is just so gorgeously done for twenty dollars, you have to go to someone for twenty dollars. I know you. It would take you so many times to do it over and over and over to perfect it, just like this. And look so how pretty. pretty it looks on the front porch. How many of you have a deck and you're going to be sitting out, you know, around your fire pit? Or how many of you love to change your artwork? Or like you, Ginger, I love how you just put it on an easel. You could put it on an mm -hmm. easel as part of your fall display. I mean, I don't know about anybody else, but I kind of do fall in, and I did my fall indoors over the yes. weekend. And then I do some oh, fall outside with mums and pumpkins. And then I switch it once we hit October to, you know, hardcore Halloween. So <laughs> <laughs> I do the same thing, or I just kind of add Add to it and I add mm -hmm. you know a few other decorations and and of course the Halloween the scary the pumpkin you carve the pumpkins and you know get some ideas with that but then when the pumpkins go away I still keep my my um, fall decor out until yeah, after Christmas. right until holiday. after Thanksgiving right mm -hmm. and then you you, you kind of take it down gradually which is kind of sad because you know you, you know Christmas is coming which is happy but you know that no it's coming and I don't know about that so much. <laughs> I do love Christmas, but I don't want the snow. But you're not crazy about the snow, huh? And I'm just showing well, one everybody. one snowman a year. That's what, it. That's what... it. <laughs> I love it. Um, and I also love the fact that it's done on a screen. So whatever you put it up against, it really changes the look of it. It's magnificent. It does. For 1996. It... I mean, even if mm -hmm. you don't know who you're going to give it to, housewarming gift. You know, someone just starting out. Maybe you don't have a whole lot of, you know, your your kids or your grandkids, niece, nephew moving into an apartment or maybe assisted living and you want to put it on your door. Yeah. You could put it on your door if you want to instead of a you could, Right? I love that idea. That's something that is, you know, you get clever with it. Have fun yes. with it. If you don't want to put a hole in the wall, you can certainly hang it and put it next mm -hmm. to an easel or on an easel. It's an easy decorating well, piece, piece. Gather <laughs> is most popular, but... Oh, 700 remain and gather? Okay. And then happy fall, 650. There's your happy fall with the white. That's really, really pretty. All right, coming up in 10 minutes. Thank you.